Prince Malachi. of a nation tour in DeSoto, Texas, and we have Shayna and Tierra Slow. All right, we're here, and we want to know what did you get out of the tour? Uh, our presenters, Brother Morris and Brother Joshua, were great, and one of the things I really appreciate is being able to silently identify with who we are and what that means for our everyday life. As well, um, understanding how significant it is and prophecy in times. And just understanding that there's a bigger picture that we're not seeing. And so, most important, um, along with that, understanding that this is not a, super a superiority thing, this is not a racial thing, it's, this is a covenant thing. And we serve the covenant God. And I think that's one thing we have to understand in, in this whole message. Is not, that this message is for all nations, for all people, but we all are going to be one nation in, in the most high. So. That's what we awesome. And just to let you guys know, this is the contact to get in touch with DeSoto, Texas. They are going to be starting a, a gathering out here. It's just like another extension of the Rebirth of Nation that's going to be in Texas. We're going to have brothers that's going to be heading up. But this is how you contact people right here. Brother Terrence Lowe and his family and his wife. All right. Shalom. One, two, three. All right. We had the Rebirth of a Nation tour in DeSoto, Texas. And we have brother Ty Brown. All right, brother Ty. Let us know how beneficial the tour was to you today. Well, I tell you, it's a, it's a lot of meat to chew all at one time, but it was great, um, very informative. Um, I encourage you guys to, to catch them when they're in your city. And uh, I love these brothers, man. They came down here and, uh, you know, we met last night and I got with them again today. And I mean, it, I know we have more learning to do and we're gonna have them back. And when they come back, it's gonna be a little bigger. It's gonna be a little better, but I, uh, I, I really, really encourage you guys to support this ministry, and I uh, love these guys. And like I said, when they're in your city, do what it takes to get down there. We actually have some people. Uh, DeSoto is actually just south of Dallas, and we have some people that came from Oklahoma City. So wow. if they can make it. You can make it. You're around your area. Cool. All right, we're here at the Rebirth of a Nation tour in DeSoto, Texas, and we have... Alicia Shepard-Jones and Renita Isbeth. Oh, we want to ask you guys, what did you get out of the tour and how beneficial was it? Alicia? Um, it, was, it was very beneficial. One of the things that I would like to encourage families to do is to educate their children on the history of their culture and to recognize that there really isn't a black person or a white person because we all came from Mr. and Mrs. Noah. And so there is, there needs to be an appreciation in our culture for the fact that we are, the Israelites did come over and that we are all Jews and that we are all grafted into this tree which is Christ. And I think that it's very important for our young people to know this. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> I learned of my history, and I've been in churches for so long, and 
finally it's making sense to me um, where we came from. And this history, I think everybody should learn because it does open up the scriptures to you. It teaches you things that you probably didn't learn in church. And it gives you an understanding about who you are. And it just opened up, it has blown my mind. I think everybody should come to one of these if you can. We drove over, but if you have to fly over, come to one of them. And go to the YouTube pages because I've learned a lot about the uh, certain things and they answer a lot of questions while you're sitting there at your home in the convenience of your, your couch and you're sitting there learning about the things of God. And I just think it, this is just the most wonderful thing and I'm so glad and blessed that I had to come. All right, we're here at the Rebirth of a Nation tour, and we have Brother Dominic. Brother Dominic. All right, so we asked you to tell us how beneficial was the tour to you. Oh, very beneficial. Uh, broke down scriptures and, and really helped us on um, basically identifying who we are and basically being able to um, actually have a conversation with people um, regarding uh, Hebrew people and um, the information and uh, questions that people are asking us. It really helps you in the walk and um, actually um, bringing other people in, which, which is our job. Um, so I, it's very beneficial, very beneficial. I, I think uh, Brother Morris and, and Brother Josh have um, been very in, in, instrumental for me for, I guess, the last year. So um, if you guys have not, uh, have not decided if you want to come out to this tour, I beg you to, to, to think about it and actually get whatever you need to get together and come out and see these brothers and, and take a listen to what they have oh, to say. All right, we're here at the Rebirth of a Nation tour in DeSoto, Texas, and we have... Karen Travia Osborne, Oklahoma City. Oklahoma City, that's about three hours away, man. That's, we appreciate you coming that far. And we want to ask you how beneficial was the conference or the tour for you? to fellowship with other uh, believers, uh, coming into this knowledge of who we are, um, finding it in the scriptures, and uh, solidifying in our heart who we are. And it, it was just refreshing, very refreshing. I don't know, it's something that we've been look, looking for for a long time, and, and we found it. We found it. And I highly recommend for anybody that would take the time and just do their due diligence you know, and getting into knowing who they are as a people and, 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 and doing an investigation. You know, just don't pass it off, but really do, do get into the word and find out who you are. And I'd recommend attending the, the tour when it comes to your to your town. I think you will you will greatly benefit. Uh, it's an open environment for you to ask questions. Uh, to get all your questions answered, and that uh, you'll meet with like mind, you'll develop new relationships, um, and you'll get answers to your questions just by fellowshipping with the with the other brothers and sisters who are here. So it's a real, it was a real joy, a yeah. real treat. Real treat. One, two, three. All right, we're here at the Rebirth of a Nation tour in Texas, and we have Sister Shamara. All right, Sister Shamara, what did you get out of the tour? Well. Um, I got a, a, a wealth of information from the brothers, some things that a lot of it was uh, some things that I had learned before. I'm very fresh into this information, into you know this, this knowledge, but I did get a lot of information from the brothers that I hadn't heard before. So, um, and I appreciate being able to get together. This is my first time in person being able to get together with people like-minded. You know, otherwise I was just on, on YouTube or seeing things <laughs> online, but being able to gather with other brothers and sisters who um, are also in this knowledge, it, it was a very, it was a very information, a very uh, blessed, I had a blessed time. I, I really did. Awesome, awesome. All right, we here at the Rebirth Tour in Texas, Dallas, Texas, and we have brother, brother, uh, brother Brown. All right, you tell us how how the experience you had. I can tell you right now that this was a plump, pleasing pleasure of a time. Uh, I've been following the Hebrew Nation building on YouTube for some years now, and to have them here in Texas to be to be able to bring this truth that. Uh, our people are missing is just unbelievable because of the simple fact we're missing out on a lot of things that are happening right now and but there's a strong awakening right now with the children of Israel and so what I would share with everybody uh, on the next tour where Hebrew Nation building will be 
uh, gathering and sh uh, having their event at, get some of your people that know nothing about this truth and get them out and just, you know, even if you have to pay them to come <laughs> with you, bring them to this, uh, to the next event where they're going to be at and let them explain to you who you are as a people because it's not being spoken in the churches. If you can ask your pastor now, if your pastor that you've been in all these years for the past however many years you've been there, if they're not speaking Deuteronomy 28, uh, our history, and they're not telling you who the real true children of Israel are, then there are half truths being spoken in your church. So instead of me, because I'll start preaching it, <laughs> just let you know this is an un, this is just one of the events that is going to be happening in one of your towns and one of your cities. Take it to your take it to, to, to your advantage that this is going to be something that's going to be dwelled within your spirit that you're going to be opened up to receiving the knowledge and the knowledge is the truth that the Most High is going to pour on you. So thank you Hebrew Nation Building, thank you brothers, Brother Morris for coming on out 